What is up guys and welcome to my Arctic Zero review and taste test. So part of the reason Arctic Zero is so light in calories is because the base instead of being at like fatty milk is water and whey protein. So water freezes a lot harder than dairy products. So they are very, very rock solid, and what I've noticed is that if you take it out of the freezer and try to eat it, it's impossible. It's like as hard as a rock for any flavor that they make. So, Angelica gave me this little postcard right here where it says to let them thaw for about 10, 15 minutes before you dig in, because it gives it a much creamier texture. But instead, to speed it up, I'm just gonna microwave all of them for like five to seven seconds. So here we go. So guys, just took them out of the microwave, put them in there for about 15 seconds, but I put all of them in there at once. So the flavors that were sent to me were, let's start with this one, buttery pecan, salted caramel, cool mint chip, key lime pie, and of course, cookie dough, which is the one I've been trying to find for a very, very long time and I have not been able to find it. We're going to start with a salted caramel one because it is only 150 calories for this whole thing. I'm just going to have a couple spoonfuls of each one, give you guys a rating of 1 to 10. Uh, I'm going to give you a taste rating, I'm going to explain the texture, and then tell you guys the macros for each one. I'll put the macros on the screen as I eat it. So, oh, i got to get a spoon. So my spoon. Just a little backstory. Originally, Arctic Zero only had what they called the creamy blends, which were all 150 calories, as you guys can see with the whole pint. Uh, macros were all the same at zero fat, seven grams of carbs, three grams of protein, and two grams of fiber per serving. So multiply that by four. Um, and then it wasn't until recently that they came out with their chunky pints, which is all these other ones that I have right here that we're going to try. That have been, they're impossible to find in stores. So, here we go. Let's dig into the first one. This is salted caramel. This is one of their new creamy flavors. Um, it's pretty. Let me get one more scoop here. It has like a hint of a caramel taste. It's pretty good. It'll like if you're if you're cutting and you have a sweet tooth and you want to just down a whole pint. I mean, it gets the job done. It'll definitely keep me full. It's more of an icy consistency than like creamy milk. I'll give it like a 7 out of 10. Maybe 6.5. I've had the vanilla, which is delicious. I would give that one like an 8, but this is... I'm not a huge caramel guy to begin with. I mean, I would eat it. I'm still going to eat the whole thing at some point. But... And it is creamier once you melt it a little bit. So... We'll give this guy six and a half, seven out of ten. Salted caramel. All right, now to the chunky ones. I'm gonna try the one that I think I'm not gonna like because I'm not a big believer in mixing minty stuff with chocolate. So, cool mint chip is up next. Now the macros for these guys are all the same as well, but so the whole thing is 300 calories, and I'll give you the macros for one serving, which is a quarter of it. Two grams of fat. 11 grams of carbs, 3 grams of protein, 3 grams of fiber. So the whole thing would be 8 fat, 44 carb, 12 protein. Good little post-workout meal. So this is what it looks like. It smells minty. Let's dig in here. As you can see, a little chocolate chip in there. Pretty good, guys. Has a good fresh minty flavor. I mean, there's a lot of chocolate chips, surprisingly. I usually hate mint, 
but I would eat this. This is definitely like an eight. Give it like an eight, coming from a non non mint liker or non mint, also very creamy texture. All right, on to the next buttery pecan. Here it is, same macros, actually 2.5 fat, 10 carb, 3 protein, 3 fiber. Ooh, it smells good. I do love pecan, I love pecan pie, I like pecan pretty much everything. But, let's give this one a go. This just goes in a lot smoother. Wow, look at all the pecan chunks in there. This is good. It's very like, you can tell that it's clean. Like there's not a lot of ingredients used. Like the pecans taste natural, organic. Really good though. Eight and a half, easy. So now on. Key lime pie, I didn't know they made this flavor. It smells delicious. I love key lime pie. That's what it looks like. So I bet you those little pieces are, actually let me read you the macros. Two fat, 11 carb, three protein, three fiber. All right, let's dig in here. I wanna get a little bit of everything. So you guys can see there's probably like graham cracker crust pieces in there. Tastes more like an icy with little graham cracker pieces, but they're big chunks. Mm. If you like key lime pie, just ordered like 20 of these. <laughs> Alright, and then last but not least, guys, what I've been wanting to try for such a long time cookie dough. 2.5 fat, 11 carb, 3 grams of fat, or 3 grams of protein and free fiber. So this is what it looks like. I'm gonna get a chunk. Oh. So it tastes like the vanilla maple one with chocolate chips and some cookie dough. I don't know how they fit so much stuff in here and keep the macro so low. Nine and a half out of ten. Like this replaces. I mean, okay. The vanilla ice cream. You're not. It's not gonna be like full fat ice cream. But for what you're getting, you can sit down and eat this entire thing. No problem. Like I'm gonna eat the, the rest of this. <laughs> no lie. So my favorite one, cookie dough. Then I would give it to the butter. Let's rate them. So cookie dough one, butter pecan, buttery pecan second, key lime pie third. Cool mint fourth, and sadly, salted caramel. But it's only, but for a reason, because it is only 150 calories. Last in this little array, and also they came out with their own like ice cream bars, which I definitely need to try. But yeah, that's gonna do it for this video, this review. Hopefully you guys enjoy. Hopefully, like somebody got some use out of it when trying to buy it. Cookie dough. Everybody needs to get this and just stock the fridge with this if they're trying to lose weight, because this replaces all ice cream. It kills all cravings. Um, all Arctic Zero is lactose free, so no dairy. GMO free, high in fiber for ice cream. Has protein, which is good. They pride themselves in being very clean. Like in the ingredient list, top three things you always look at. It has purified water, which is the main. Whey protein concentrate, concentrate and then organic cane sugar. So, all very, very clean, as you guys can see from the cover. List everything there. You don't have to feel guilty while eating one of these. I might have two of them today, I don't really care. But yeah guys, that's gonna do it for this video. Hopefully you enjoyed. Don't forget to comment, like, subscribe. It really helps the channel grow. I'm loving the support lately. Check the guns. Until next time guys, don't forget to follow me on Instagram, Periscope, and Twitter. Oh, and I'll have links in the description for how to get these and where to get them. Until next time, guys.
Cue that outro. Peace.